Being hospitalized is not uncommon for many who get a severe case of COVID-19, but what if you could pop a series of pills to treat the disease and keep yourself out of the hospital? A drug maker behind one of the COVID vaccines says it now has a pill that will do just that. Ground Force Dan Kerman live for us at UCSF in the city with the exciting news, Dan. That's right, infectious disease specialists here say this could be a game changer. Pfizer, the latest to join others that have developed a pill that they say really can make a dent for those who get COVID-19. It's a game changer is because it's, it's a step of up from where we are right now. COVID-19 vaccine maker Pfizer is now asking the FDA to grant emergency use authorization for Paxlovid a pill doctors could prescribe to treat those infected with COVID-19. You're a healthcare professional calling a prescription to Walgreens. You go to Walgreens, you pick up your five pack um, course and you start taking it. And um, lo and behold, it prevents you from going to the hospital. Pfizer says its studies show high risk unvaccinated volunteers who started taking the pills within three days of getting symptoms greatly reduce their risk of severe disease and death. Here's a way that we could tolerate having a certain amount of transmission going on, but not squeezing the hospitals and the hospital beds uh, for, um, uh, for space. Infectious disease experts say these pills provide yet another tool in the toolbox in the fight against COVID-19. People who've been hesitant to get vaccines um, and who get infected might not be hesitant to get drugs. Um, and this may be a, a different approach for certain parts of the, uh, the country where um, vaccination coverage is, is much lower. Studies are also underway to see if this same pill could be given to those in the same household as someone with COVID to prevent the others from getting the virus. I think in the future what will happen too is I could also give medicines to the five people in the household who've been in contact with me but who are negative so far from becoming positive. Infectious disease specialists are quick to point out that these pills are no replacement for the vaccine. That remains the number one priority. At this point, unclear when the FDA will review Pfizer's request. Live at UCSF, Dan Kerman, Cron 4 News.